Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Russian Fishing 4, where I'm taking out Yama River. I am back at our favorite spot, which is a 3.5 meter depth spot right beside the camp. And I'm trying a two rod jig step, guys. My very first episode that I released, I believe, day before yesterday, I uh, was using only one rod and we made, what, 334 bucks in one hour? And I wanted to see if I can do better with two rods. And guess what, guys? I'm doing much better with two rods. The only unfortunate thing is I moved to this spot very late in the day. Uh, but let me fight the salmon and then I will share all the deets with you. Guys, I've been fighting this fish since evening. Um, the last cutscene you just saw. The entire night I fought this fish. I don't know what the hell it is. I don't know how long it's been. 25 minutes, 20 minutes. However long in-game one entire night is. That's how long it's taken me. This fish is absolutely insane. It is a Chinook. I don't know if this is a trophy or not. It was burning my Tagara here and there. It doesn't do a long continuous burn. It will burn just for like 2-3 seconds. And it did that in the first, you know, 5 minutes of the fight. Then it did that 15, like 10 minutes later, 5 minutes later. Absolutely insane. I will be honest with you guys. I will rather fight a sturgeon than this stupid thing. It is insanely powerful. And it just destroyed my 26.5 kg Tagara. You guys have no idea how stressful this fight was. Because... Um, the tension goes all the way to the red, then it goes to zero, then it goes to green, then it goes to red. And for such a long time, I thought, oh no, there is absolutely no tension. Did I lose the fish? Because it will do that continuously. And I think I'm finally winning the battle here. It's almost here. Remember at the bottom, the circle, you see that's almost three fourths full. Um... It doesn't mean all of that line is out. It means that my Tagara can hold 425 meters of this 29 kg line I have. And this line is only, I think I only have 300 meters of it. Uh, so it's not really indicative of what I'm really holding. If that made sense. I completely lost the train of thought there. Because I'm so focused on this fish. I want to look down to see if it's right by me now. But it still is it's a little bit far. I'm going to keep uh, reeling it in. Guys, it's almost in. Oh my god, please be a trophy, Chinook. I'm very, very confident that it is not a trophy. I don't know how big these guys get. And we already saw how powerful a 15 kg Chinook can be. Even to the very end, guys, my break is at 29 on this 26.5 kg Tagara, and it does not want to come in. Okay, here we go. Unless it's a Kaluga. Oh my god, look how freaking big that is, guys. That is a monster. That is 100% trophy. That has to be. Oh my god, 43.96 kg. Wow, that was epic. I should have drank XP drinks. Oh my god, what a freaking beast. Wow, that's a half hour fight, guys. Wow. Okay, here's the quick down low on the spot. 170 to 10 is where I am. I'm casting into the 3.5 meter hole. If you look at the first video I uploaded on Yama, I think I was around here somewhere. I was casting into the 3.5 meter hole. Guys, I'm using two rods and it is better. I am catching more fish. Now, I moved to the spot 40 minutes ago. Okay, so discount uh, all of these other fish. I was at another spot. It sucked. Okay, like in 41 minutes, then 38 minutes, 3.4, 35 minutes, 6.4, 34 minutes, 2, and then the 30 minute, 28 to 30 minute fight for this Chinook. And people are messaging me. Oh my God, it is so busy right now. Uh, the leaders, I'm using again, exact same setup here, guys. 
30 kg rod, 26.5 kg tagara, uh, 28.5 kg line, 27.1 kg, 60 centimeter liter, and the Kurai Satori Iruna Satori 22 gram. And I'm using size one hook with the red fluff. That's all I'm using. My friction break is at 15% now. I don't know how much break damage it was before the fight, but I'm very sure it took out like 5% at least. This, this thing was insane. Let's go ahead fish for uh, the entire day until the evening, and then we will go ahead and sell our fish and see how much we made. Guys, just wanted to show you what I'm doing here. At the spot, two uh, setups exactly the same. Retrieval speed 35. And I'm just quickly switching between these two. And as you can see, it says jig step two. Move this all the way. Let me cast it. And uh, I'm just experimenting if two rods will get you more fish. Uh, the little bit of time I've spent, yes, it does matter. Uh, it does work rather. Getting more fish. Uh, again, that fight took so long that I won't be able to spend another full hour, I think. But uh, we will see either way. We should have at least a very good picture after uh, how much time I've spent here. And it's too bad there isn't a Chinook order right now, cafe order. Maybe there is, I don't know. But uh, I can't wait to see how much this Chinook is worth. Guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. I really appreciate the support. Uh, please like the video right now and uh, comment below what you think. I have a regional record right now. Once it updates on the leaderboards, I will take a quick video of that as well. Let's see what this fish is. I'm getting all sorts of fish. Oh yeah, look at that beauty. Coho salmon. I've caught a few coho salmon here. This spot, honestly guys, is the best one in the game. Uh, in Yama rather. So far, I've tried 3 meter hole, I've tried 2.5 meter hole, I've tried this 3.5 meter hole, all trash. Uh, to put it lightly. There's the bear with its cub. Hopefully it does not cross the border into our side or else uh, we're gonna have to beat it with our, uh, with our salmon. Look at that, another beauty here. This is a sockeye, it's too small, but we have caught a sockeye, have we not? No, we have not. I've caught non-marker sockeyes so far at this spot. Um, I'm guessing smaller leaders will get us more of these rare fish, but uh, it's going to take us too long to retrieve them in. Look at that. Wow, it's really working right now. Even if they are non-markers. Uh, so this is absolutely great. What we got here? Oh, that's a chum, isn't it? Yep. Chummy chum. Chum are absolutely worthless because uh, they're the most common. And everyone is getting a trophy. So the trophy price, I think, started at 60 silver. And now it's down to like 47 silver. So the more people sell, um, the faster and less worth the fish are. Which is absolute bullcrap because the grind is already <laughs> real in this game. So, you know, it would we would appreciate it if we could have ways of increasing our income. Look at that. Man, this is insane. And now imagine if we had three rods out. Um, I don't want to do three rods because that's way too much. Even these two rods are insane. Dolly, Warden, Trout, 1.3 kg. That's a baby, but wow. Look at that. That is pretty darn sweet. Okay. You're going to have to find this rhythm, guys. But uh, in order to get the jig step to come up, you'd really have to switch between your rods quickly. Uh, even though I prefer to let it sink longer. Because the longer it sinks, the high. Oh, wow. Look at that. Another coho. The higher the chance. Man, these cohos should be worth a pretty penny, right? Because they look absolutely beautiful. All these salmons look beautiful. Oh my god, yes. Even the chum looks like military fish. Uh, it's too bad they're worth or priced to very little. I'm doing really quick switching between 
And uh, it's working. That's how Jig Step is, I guess. And we are catching fish. So letting the lure sink like I was using the single rod isn't really necessary. And that cub keeps disappearing and coming back. What the hell is going on up there? I do not want to cross into their territory. I don't think you can. There we go. Wow, I thought I was going to go without a fish here. Uh, but no, we actually caught something. Looks like a non-marker, sadly. No, another one. Oh, heck yes. Man, look at this. 13 minutes ago is our last fish. And we're doing pretty darn well. There we go. I'm one, two, three, four. I'm fourth place in other region because that's the region I'm at. If you go hover over here, other region. One, two, three, fourth place, 43.967 kg. Look at that. Biggest one is 47 kg. That is insane. If you go to all regions, I want to see. Nookie nook. Oh, wow. Look at that. 70 kg, 57 kg, 53. That's insane. Oh my god. Uh, but uh, damn. Very nice. Look at this. What is this? A Chinook. Okay. Okay. 7.57. I forgot how they look like. Another one. Okay. Oh my god. Wow. Look at that. This one is sort of pink. Nice. Okay, guys, so uh, that's going to be it. Let's go ahead. Cafe, unfortunately, nothing here at the cafe. If we look at our fish here, I've been here 1 hour 12 minutes. Half hour from that was taken for the Chinook. But guys, look at this. In 10 minutes, these chums are absolutely worthless. But look at how many fish I caught with two rods. Okay, in 10 minutes, I've also got... Non-marker Chinook 6.6. .6. I got another non-marker Chinook over here in between. Uh, we have a sockeye non-marker as well. We have a sockeye salmon here 1.2. If we go by weight, uh, we have 43 kg Chinook. We have 7.57 kg Chinook marker, non-marker. And then we have chums 6.5, 6.4, 4.6, 4.6, .4, 4. Uh, coho, chum, 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 more coho, dolly, varden. We have a few. Uh, so let's go ahead quickly and look at the prices. Oh my god, 1,321 silver. Heck yeah, that's as much as a Russian sturgeon, guys. Uh, so look at that. Russian sturgeon takes me 40 to 50 minutes on uh, the Tagara. It's, uh, it's, you know what, it's, it's still stressful, but not as stressful as the Chinook. I feel like the Chinook has destroyed my reel more than, uh, than a Sturge. So in 1 hour 12 minutes, we only made 275 silver, which is pretty darn good considering the fact I spent half hour on this. Granted, it was nighttime, but I feel like we would have been at 300 silver anyway if I hadn't caught this because uh, we did miss a little bit of morning time and evening time. Overall... 1,600 silver. There we go. Personal record. Most expensive fish. Nice. That is has finally beaten my Russian sturgeon. I like this now. We have catfish. We have taman. Russian sturgeon. Chinook salmon. Now we have variety. Or before that it was everything was Russian sturgeon everywhere. Uh, so there you go. Absolutely amazing. Guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. I will see you in the next episode. Tomorrow, I will be streaming as well on Friday over here. And let's see what I can get on stream. Bye, guys.